Hi, Violin families, Mr. Washam here. It was an amazing week of Violin. We were jam packed full of a lot of stuff. So, this week in the email, have several things. I've got a link to last week's art show that took place in the Vineland Gym. So, you can click that. It's a completely separate video. It's a four and a half minute video of all the artwork for students kindergarten all the way through sixth grade. We've got our weekly athletics update in there. Next week is also map testing, starting with third grade on Monday. So I've got some uh, map reminders that is also linked in the video. Things reminding your students to get extra sleep, eat a good breakfast, all the things that are gonna help them out with the map test as we've been preparing for this all year. So good luck all students with the map test next week. We also had an assembly today to get us ready for the map test. And so we had some silly games that we played in there. I got some pictures of the administrators were part of an ice bath. And we have one retiree for next year, Miss Cindy Nestor, who spent over 30 years in the district. We cannot thank Miss Nestor enough for her service and commitment to the students, faculty, staff, and just the community of DeSoto as she's been with the school for over 30 years. We wish you well in retirement, Miss Nestor. Finally, there's some information for the book fair that takes place next week and some special events that Miss Lutz has going on in the morning that can involve parents. So parents, check that out. You can come to some special events in the morning before school starts. Everybody have a great weekend. Be safe. It's a great day to be a dragon. Thank you, Miss Nestor, for your 30 plus years of service to the DeSoto School District. Isabella Tate was our recipient of the Inspiration Award this year. We gave a special recognition to our Special Olympic athletes and their achievements that they had last week at the high school during the Special Olympic track meet. And finally, congratulations to all our fourth, fifth, and sixth graders who placed proficient and advanced on last year's map test, which earns them the opportunity to go on a field trip the last week of school to the Bonterre Family Fun Center. Congratulations to all these outstanding students.